So, viewers, it's actually a really good thing I came into the menu because we actually can cure that arrow in our leg. Ah, uh, no. <laughs> anyway, took care of that. Now, here's what we want to do. We want these two guns, I believe. Yeah, we want our, um, well, actually, it says that he, he recommends using, because I looked up a guide, because I wanted to make sure that you don't have to actually tranquilize this guy. It says that you should use the tranquilizer, but that's weird, because we're trying to kill him, not, uh, tranquilize him. But, um, it's a good idea to just lower his stamina, at least that's the only reason why you would need to. But you also want to equip all of the food you have that's nasty as shit. So... Take that off. Take this off. Take that off. Okay, so that'll help us out right there. Now the reason why you want to do this is because he'll actually come and grab this stuff later and it can actually help you out a lot. Now you actually also want to equip your uh, shotgun if he ever comes near you. So let's do that real quick. That's the M37. Yep. Oh, that's the one that he talked about. He didn't say the MK22. So you want your shotgun in case he ever comes close to you, and you want the AK-47 for whenever he's far away. So let's grab that. Let's see if we can't find him. Now I'm here. You actually don't want to move a whole lot, it says, but. Yeah, if you do get shot by a crossbow. You are going to be screwed they do a lot of damage. If you have a thermal goggles, that makes this fight a bazillion times easier because then you can easily just find them. But other than that, you're um, kind of screwed on finding them. Doesn't scare me at all.
so you notice that he uh, ate the shit food that I put down. And uh, what that does is it actually screws him over where he now can't actually stay camouflaged very well. So you definitely want to do that. See, like, now it's like all sparkly and stuff. Yeah, this attack is kind of dangerous because uh, he can come up and hit you. But I couldn't touch. Couldn't see him in time. Got him. <laughs> the fear! The fear! I see it! The fear! They all die in a really cool way, at least. They all explode. <laughs> Phew. And just remember, as always, to take your time coming through here. It's said to be tasty. You ate some without even asking me? <laughs> Snake, that area is inhabited by European rabbits. The European rabbit is said to have come from the Mediterranean. I think you've already told me this before. <laughs> Snake, that area is inhabited by the poison dart frog. The poison dart frog is native to the tropical rainforests of Central and South America. They normally grow between two and five centimeters in length, but for some reason the ones in that area seem to be much bigger than that. Poison dart frogs are known to carry a potent neurotoxin called homiliotoxin. Long ago people used the poison to coat their arrows for hunting. Watch out because if you eat one, you'll get food poisoning. Huh. I was debating if I want to kill that rabbit or not. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so let's see what we can transform into. Okay, that helps us out a little bit. Still not very well protected. Here we go, let's try that. Mm, it's 
still able to be seen very well, so that sucks. Not to mention we don't have any um, suppressors on our tranquilizer gun anymore. It's kind of quiet in here. What the fuck are you doing? Yeah, I'm asking myself the same question. Do I have to equip the card in this game? I don't know, that's a good question. Hmm, doesn't look like it. <sighs> Let's see if we can't even cure ourselves. Probably not, cause probably, yeah, about to run out of porn stuff.
Wrong damn button. Work with me here. There you go. According to Granin, you should be able to get to the mountains through a passage located deep in the jungle beyond the warehouse. Right. Then if I climb the mountains, there'll be an underground tunnel leading to Groznegrad near the summit. Use the key you got from Granin to open the door and proceed into the jungle. You remember where the door is, don't you? It's directly north of the door you went in when you came from the aqueduct. Directly north from the door as you came from the aqueduct. Okay. I'm gonna check something. Bandage is just this stuff. Yeah, it is. Okay. Just curious. Looks like I'm going to be moving through a lot of brush, so let's put on leaf. Snake, are you there? Eva, where are you? In the fortress, in Groznygrad. Dr. Sokolov is here too. Is he alright? He's fine. Right now he's busy putting the finishing touches on the Shagglehot. Good. That means they haven't killed him. Not yet, anyway. But you better hurry. They've already finished the Phase 2 tests. Once the final preparations are complete, they'll have no more use for him. The Colonel won't have any qualms about killing him if he thinks the CIA is closing in. Eva, you can't let Sokolov out of your sight. I know. Snake, do you know where Groznygrad is? Granin told me that I should be able to get there from the mountains to the north, through an underground tunnel. Granin told you? Yeah. He even gave me the key to the warehouse. Why? Because he was drunk, I guess. You've got to be kidding me. Hell if I know. Snake, there's one problem with that route. What problem? The mountain entrance to the underground tunnel that leads to the fortress is sealed. You need a key to get in. A key? What about the key Granin gave me? That key won't work. But don't worry, I'll figure something out. I have an idea. There are some ruins at the top of the mountains. Meet me there. The top of the mountains. Got it. Wait. There's something else I've got to tell you. Now what? I heard that one of the cobras is waiting for you in the jungle at the foot of the mountains. He's a legendary sniper called The End. Yeah, I've seen him before. That ridiculously old guy, right? Don't underestimate him. He's known as the father of modern sniping. Is he alone? No spotter? None. He's all by himself. Apparently, he doesn't need a spotter. You can't be serious. The entire forest is on his side. The forest? Stay alert. Yeah. I'd hate to have it be the end for me. <laughs>
There may not actually be anything out here, but I want to make absolutely sure. Oh, cool, I can have the active sonar and that on. How does this work again? L3. Poison dart frog. That ain't gonna help me. Aw, a rabbit. I don't know why I'm even bothering trying to find food, <laughs> considering. Damn it, my food's starting to go bad. Can't complain. Well, that's too bad. What the hell is this? <laughs> Gold medicine. Oh. Shit, I forgot about that. I need to be like cutting down these plants sometimes. How does that make a splint? <laughs> huh, can't complain, really. Disinfectant, I need more of that, so that's good. Look at that, it's a snake. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Seems pretty clear now. What? Ha. I'm just seeing things. Hell yeah, you are. Don't make me shoot your ass. <laughs> Not that I can. I don't really have very much stuff. I actually need to hold him up if I can. Because he'll give me more uh, 
things, but... Oh, there's more than just one guy. So if I can hold them up, then I could, you know, go and, uh, get something else. Like, here, let's try this. Okay, so he's not moving anymore. You fucking move, you bastard. There you go. Wait, now he's gone. snake in here, so I gotta be careful. Stop it. Okay, so now he's behind me. Good to know. Okay, there's that guy. Nothing here. Forgot about that. <laughs> it's a clever little thing. I'm happy that it actually makes enough noise to count that. go. Hmm. There he is. Shoot me, please. Seriously, nothing else? <laughs> Bastard. <laughs> don't shoot me, please. <laughs> I don't know why I'm laughing, but oh my god. When you get hurt, your body will heal itself naturally over time. However, the speed at which your life recovers depends on how much stamina you have at the time. The more stamina you have, the faster you'll recover. So if you want your wounds to heal quickly, you should eat something and replenish your stamina first. 
I just realized we're at 31 minutes, so I'm going to take a break. When we come back, we will see what's going on. Till then, everyone. Bye.